it's your girl Christine and shout out to the official buddy Rodney Burgess who suggested this Halloween react suggestion. This is how to survive a Halloween mugging by tabs. Now, I didn't know that this, okay, A, I don't know if this is a story time video or an animated, like, animation uh, video. If this is a story time video, I didn't know that this was a thing, like Halloween muggings. But when you think about it, I'm sure there's a mugging every day. So I don't think Taps is saying specifically muggings that happen on, you know, we actually it might be that's the case. How to survive being mugged on Halloween. Oh, maybe it's a candy mugging, like stealing candy. Let's watch the video. We're going to find out what she means exactly. Link is in the description box below for you to check out. Now let's get started. I love Halloween. I like it too. I, I, each year I'm getting Take a more guess. into it. Harley Quinn? Wait, a panda? The queen uh, on a chessboard? I don't um, know. Two Face? Yeah, nope. I'm not sure. I'm just one of those guys who put up a nice front but also don't know how to control my edgy dark side because I oh, got okay. rejected one too many times. Oh dear. <laughs> oh, goodness. Then I was like, oh. everybody steer clear of this guy's way if you see him. It's okay. for your own safety. All Maybe right. I did this before it was cool, but I'm still too old to go trick or treating. So this is kind of a waste. Okay. Nothing's really changed from last year with me just staying home and splurging well, on candy. Well, I give candy. the candy out. Sure, I know it's much easier to just buy your own candy that day, but you can't mm -hmm. tell me that it's not fun to make it a contest to see Sorry, who gets the, the most candy you out of all one. your friends. Suck it, ben. Tell you what, I'll save you time Holy right crap. now and tell you who can pass off for trick or treating. Dear. I have the door slammed on hold them on, by some Hold on, hold on, hold on. Why is homie's wedgie so far up? Could he not? Oh crap, there's the bulge. Oh my goodness, forget I said that. Tell you who forget can that. pass off for trick or treating. Oh my goodness, what's up with I have the door hers? slammed on them by some killjoys for being too old. What's up with the crashes on them people? Who can go Kids trick or treating? Kids and early teens who actually oh, look, look the their minion. age. And then adults in their mid-twenties who are blessed with genetics that oh make them look like they're only 15 gosh. years old. But they can probably buy their own large bag of candy at that point. Blessed and with finally, genetics? I mean, not, not to blessed. be hideous, but if you're over six feet tall, then I have some news for you. What? You're probably gonna get rejected. Dear. Now, for those of you that are planning to go trick-or-treating, I got some tips for you to stay alive. Okay. Stay alive? Stay alive? Well, What's she gonna... that supposed to mean? Stay Alright, no. Settle down. We just happen to have a lot of pedos and freaks that like oh, coming out of their basements Oh night my gosh. see this as some sort of opportunity to Holy crap. the shit. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. You've done fine the past few years if you're well and alive this watching this right now. He's my frightened. first tip, go in a group. Yes. Within that group, everyone should have something on them just in case. <laughs> I like this. There. Now that's more Holy like it. Crap. See, let's say you want to go as a diva, <laughs> then wear high-heeled shoes. Okay. No, this is cute, but I mean you gotta cute. go with the ones with the spikes on them. Like so one can... of these. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, that's oh what I'm dear. talking about. Or if you want to be Rick and Morty like everyone and their moms are gonna be this yeah, year, hold a water gun but jam it with pepper spray instead. If you're oh gonna be dear. Pennywise, also everyone in 2017, yes. I guess. I guess you just hold a red balloon. And for any yeah, reason, if you want to go as my ways. character, you hold a bat. No questions asked. Okay. So just in Don't case any anyone questions. tries to mug you for your candy, mm -hmm. at least your group has something to attack and with. And to protect it would go yourselves. something like this. Excuse me. I'm not messing with these kids. Oh dear. Has anyone been candy what mugged? Let me. Oh dear. <clears throat> To oh, she's the world from devastation to unite all people within, within our nations. What the fuck are you doing? Oh my goodness. Within our nations to denounce the evils of truth, truth and, and love. love to extend our reach to the stars, stars above. above. Jesse James. <laughs> Is he like both of them? Don't you have a friend to go as Jesse so you don't have to dress like that? Uh, yeah. Screw you, I do what I want. Dear. I gave you a free performance, so now okay. you owe me candy. Nobody asked no, for it. No, we ain't getting if it's give a me no free candy. performance, why do we owe you anything? Thank you. Just give me your bags of candy before I force you to, because <laughs> I don't want to leave five kids missing by tonight. You're going to kill us over some Twizzlers? Yeah, that's Jesus weird. Jesus Christ, you're a degenerate. Oh, goodness, I face. Prepare to fight. Okay, whoever's the diva, right. you step on his shoe oh, as hard gosh. as you can and then you kick him in the shin oh. and that one other area for a bonus Dear. he's gonna bend down because that hurts and yeah. then rick and morty are gonna point the pepper spray gun oh my in the eyes with it while whoever's holding the bat is reverse mugging him and finally the guy who's dressed oh as my goodness i guess he just pops the balloon and says boo oh, and that's so how you survive though. a halloween mugging but really in most cases that is you don't a good need way. to be that extra just don't go alone also, exactly don't attack until the guy tries to first sure. self defense exactly. you know yeah, second tip oh, don't goodness. ever eat candy that looks like it's been wrapped poorly or already open right and if you want to take extra steps double check the candy before you eat any and of say it. A we prayer. got a lot of sickos around that oh try to sneak goodness. some blades in there to mutilate kids mouths oh i mean my gosh. look at this 
the audacity of some people. <laughs> Seek G- <laughs> Oh my goodness. <laughs> I like that. Okay, when she said the audacity of some people, like this is what he had hid in the candy. When they unwrapped it, they found this. That's hilarious. That's actually hilarious. I didn't know this was like a meme that people do. Don't forget to check y'all kids' candy bags. It's Halloween. I found this in my little brother's lollipop. That's so funny. It's sad, but it's funny. Like the the meme is funny but the fact that you have to check the candy is sad because people would do I remember when I was younger it was a huge thing like this whole razor blade thing hiding razor blade in candy or apples was another thing so like it made people afraid to do like the bobbing for apples which I don't know if people do that anymore because of that like when people go to bite an apple they get cut and I'm like you're not seeing it happen you know so like what joy are you actually getting you know, it's one thing to troll somebody when you see them being affected by what you're doing. But if you give them candy that's got blades in it or an apple that's got blades in it and you're not actually watching them bite it, what joy are you getting? What sense does it make to do it? Some people are twisted and I guess that's just it. But dear, dear word. If you do this, third tip. If some right grimy in. ass looking dude okay. or any stranger in that matter tells looking you to go MF inside their house the to get the candy, no. and you dip and warn the other kids yeah, in the area to mouth. avoid the mouth breather living inside <laughs> that house. house. Call the cops if they're especially suspicious. Right. Last tip: Stay home. Don't go Be out at all that night. Turn off the lights. Wait, whoa, lock whoa, your whoa, doors and watch some scary movies at home. Scary. If you want to take extra measures, <laughs> you leave a bowl movies. of candy outside and pretend you're not home. So yeah. Nobody tries to egg your house or cover it in rolls of toilet People paper. People aren't that you crazy. Know nobody actually ever takes one candy. They don't. They see this like they this. don't. Come on, let's be real. Yeah. Be safe, okay? No matter what it is, be safe. I do agree with all the tips except for the last one like you don't have to hide or be afraid you know go out you want to go out go out with your friends be safe you know have a group of people don't go by yourself doubly inspect your candy uh it's a lot of fun for me last year for the first time i bought a bunch of candy put a chair out in my front of, um, on my driveway and was handing out candy. And I had my light light on, cause that was the rule. Like they go to homes that have the light on. I wasn't with the whole people knocking on the door thing. I was like, I'll just sit outside by the driveway. And a couple other parents did that too, where they sat on the driveway and they just handed candy out to kids that were coming by. I cannot wait to do it this year. I'm gonna dress my little baby girl up in like this Batman onesie that shout out to Tika, she got me. And it's this Batgirl onesie. It's got a little tutu on it and it came with a little bow and everything. And I'm excited to take a picture of it. And uh, I can't wait to put it on her and have her outside while I'm passing out candy. It's going to be fun. Can I have her outside? Yeah, I can have her outside. And I just won't let her touch anybody. And then nobody can touch her. They'll just get to look at her. She's not at that, hey, people can really, a lot of people can touch her stage because, you know, eh, she's got to work up her immune system and stuff. But nonetheless, enough about my adorable little cutesy. I'm excited for Halloween, and you should be too. It's a fun thing. I, I would say that as I got older, I liked Halloween more. When I was a kid, I didn't really care for it. My parents didn't really celebrate it. We've never went trick-or-treating as a kid. Um, I, we were supposed to go to my mom's like uh, office party for like family thing, but then she went late, so it was done. So we never really celebrated Halloween. But as I got older, and especially with having the channel over the last year and the year before, I've been wanting to participate more. So I'm liking it. Tell me your thoughts. What's your best Halloween or what are your tips for other people who um, are experiencing Halloween for the first time or, you know, wanting to participate for the first time? Let me know down below in the comment section. If you liked that video, check out the link in the description box below to support tabs there. If you like this video, hug the like by that like button. I love you guys as always. And until next time, booties. Toodles.